beautiful angels this is mystic c from magic wins tarot and this is your love and work forecast for cancers if your sun sign moon sign rising sign is in cancer this reading is for you if you know a cancer you can cross watch it for them make sure to subscribe magic wins tarot like share subscribe join us on instagram to buy a personal reading visit our website also friends um uh this is a general reading it may or may not resonate also this is a timeless reading you can watch it any time friends it will still help and resonate with your situation and the july horoscopes uh, pick uh, pick a card have already been done it's a very uh, detailed pick a card reading so please check it out link is in the time stamps the hindi urdu versions of these readings have already been posted so you can check that out on my other channel magic wins tarot hindi urdu so let's see cancers what is coming next for you cancers the theme oh three of wands ten of cups interesting beautiful energies cancers well done three of wands you are looking ahead to your future you are definitely building something and you are about you know you are building something in your future and you are working on it you're really feeling very excited about your future your main thought will be about your future making it safe what you want to do next where you want to travel where you want to shift relocate family for some of you family could be very important in the coming days some of you could be thinking of shifting back to your family or home country home places uh, some of you could be going um, you know i see shifting relocating uh, building a house building a family if you are single you want to be uh, you know into a relationship uh, settle down get married laying the roots your thoughts are mainly about your future like how you can improve your future what you can do where you want to be in the next 3 years so you're thinking about you're thinking a lot and i think you're going to talk a lot cancers because i see this energy of coming where you are like very talkative you have a lot on your mind and you have a lot of things to share six of swords yes finally things are moving forward for you cancers you had certain blocks in your life in your career things were not going your way but finally peace is coming happiness progress is coming obstacles are being removed for you so well done um but basically i see you getting very excited about your future making a uh, planning working for your future your future could be what you want to do next where you want to shift relocate where you want to should you want to you know some of you want to st travel abroad study abroad that's what you are thinking about or working on some of you want to shift or re relocate towards your family to your roots you want to go back to there you are thinking about all those things definitely and your life is going to move forward friends cancers and that is such a relief like finally <laughs> you had been through a lot you know may june were not easy for water signs you were you had to really shift your energy your nature from a water to a fire sign you had to be like really extremely bold and passionate and fiery to go after your dreams and right now you are at, at your home energy you can be in your own element and feel right at home like life is now cooperating with you it's not so tough for you now it's an easy easy future and time period ahead and congratulations you deserve it so who is coming for cancers <clears throat> oh my god i was not i didn't want to see the tower but it's here we'll take a clarifier worry not cancers <clears throat> five of wands <clears throat> magician the judgment the page of swords cancers you could be dealing with an aquarius libra gemini person or you could be dealing with someone who is in a long distance relationship with you or you could be dealing with a person you have just met online i feel let's click a clarifier what is this tower about four of wands marriage marriage for some of you you could be dealing like your marriage you could be if you're already married friends you could be at a point where you know you and your partner are not seeing eye to eye you're not agreeing on many things i i have to say this uh, you may feel certain doubts about your marriage this or your relationship in the coming future but i think you guys are not opposites or in disagreement you guys are like you know like you're very com uh, 
complimentary like you know one is north the you know like the it's like you know you cannot separate the two directions you you may see you guys are different but actually these differences make a lot of sense for you both so if you are married or if you are in a relationship you may be surprised that um there are certain differences with your partner but once you detach from the anger and emotion you will realize that it's actually uh these differences make you both special and unique in your own ways like you know the sun rises in the east uh, but sets in the west so both east and west are important so you may feel like this person is east this is north this is south we can't be together but i think a magnet has both north and south so that's how it is <laughs> you know opposites tend to attract and that's how it is your uh, relationships are going to be fiery your relationships are going to be passionate some of you may get if you are single out of the blue a marriage proposal may come your way and you'll be completely surprised but this is something you have manifested cancers I also feel for some of you this is like what you really want in your relationship this is a make or break time like what do you really want cancers in your love in your relationships uh, so whatever you want you will have it I also feel like if somebody did you dirty in the past like somebody left you somebody was running away from commitment there were third parties uh, you know that person will be coming back and trying to work things out with you i think someone your twin flame your soulmate is going to get an awakening a shock like you are the one for them and they're going to come for you cancer and i think there will be discussions talks in love happening and finally a clarity or a breakthrough will happen the icy cold waters will you know break and passions and love will rise <laughs> eight of pentacles yes someone is willing to work hard for your connection and this uh, relationship but i also feel for some of you cancers you are very busy at work and this will affect your love life like you you are so busy at work that at one point your partner may get angry like you don't have time for me and you are like hey baby i don't have time even for myself what can i do but um, this can lead to certain disagreement but it can also lead to beautiful make up time right make out time so <laughs> ace of swords yes breakthroughs decisions and a new start is coming for you and a very very fiery passionate time so be careful cancers in your relationships of uh, emotions passions are high as well as a chance to renew your love and relationships so what is blocking cancers <clears throat> Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag person. Yes, Queen of Swords. You could be dealing with two people this month, you know, because there is, uh, there are these two energies here also. So you could be dealing with two people, or you are with a person where third parties are affecting your life. Okay, the lovers, the Seven of Wands. So one thing that will be your block is a lack of patience. I think uh, cancers you will really be in an energy where you don't want to wait for things to work out you want to you know push things you want to you're still in that fiery energy cancer where you want to push things fast and make things work faster quicker and you know get things done get things moving but I think you should keep your patience a little uh, too much pushing or hustling may make you feel very tired exhausted and wasted I also feel at your work you may be trying to do too much and that will not help you really cancers try to be intuitive and be in your energy of water understand like when to act when not to act when to push when not to push so come back from the fire energy into the water energy uh, I think uh, there can be a conflict the main uh, another block that will affect you this month is there could be a conflict between your heart and your mind your mind could be saying one thing your heart could be saying one thing and that can lead to a problem i also feel at your work there uh, your boss may be you know you may be caught between two bosses like one is saying something the other is saying something and you are like what am i supposed to do so uh, aries fire sign aries leo sagittarius person aquarius libra gemini person both are important for you the lovers this month uh, will be coming lots of choices for you but you must be careful what you choose also there can be certain deceptions which are not evident to you cancers because of if you are pushing too hard if you are too high in emotion aggression passion you may completely overlook the other choices which are available to you cancers the other choices are patience intuition love 
perceptiveness, telepathy, all these things are available to you. Uh, listening, patient listening. I think at your workplace, you may face some struggle with your competition or struggle or conflict with the boss. But you can uh, actually heal it by listening to your boss. Like, okay, let, let me hear you out, boss. What you want to say? Yeah, yeah, I completely understand you. You know how employees talk and you will say like, yeah, I reassure you, I understand you completely. That can do your trick rather than trying to, no, I don't know what you want to say and I don't agree with you. That's going to lead to lockheads. So be careful. Ooh, cancers, you are still in a very, very fiery energy. I can tell you this thing. You can see how I'm talking very fast. That's not how I usually talk. So what are the blessings coming for cancers? Oh, star wish is coming true. Queen of Cups, love is coming. Oh my God. Get ready, cancers. Get ready. It's a juicy month for you, friends. It's juicy. It's absolutely lovely. Ah, the star, your wishes are going to come true, Cancers. What you wish for is going to come true and it's going to manifest for you. And after a long, long time, so you're going to feel really happy. Also, be careful what you wish for because you might actually get it. Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces person will be important. Uh, I also feel like, you know, your, uh, you know, this month will give you some emotional happiness, like some sort of an emotional high is coming for you. Also, some emo if you were struggling to heal from certain situations, certain emotional situations, or you felt like you were in an emotional storm in the past, at your work, in your love life, it will end and you will come back like into happiness again. So you are like, I'm back to my energy, I'm back to my home, I'm back to my ground. Em Empress, yes, I feel you will be really, anything you start will be very lucky for you. Anything you have already started, if you keep working on, it's going to turn into very lucky, especially your businesses, your side hustles, your side jobs. Um, also, the <clears throat> mother will be very important for you. Some of you could be getting some extra blessings from a mother, a grandmother in spirit or in real life. Some of you could also uh, be getting pregnant this month or childbirth energy is actually very high. So let's see your career for cancers. Oh, new beginnings. Heart chakra. Oh, recognition and rewards and celebrations. I wish I knew some songs fully so I can sing them for you, although I'm not much of a singer. I think I sing completely out of tune. <laughs> All right. Wow. This is again the star card for you, Cancers. And you were telling me like why cancer, uh, water signs are always done in the last because you get the best readings. That's why, friends, the wait is worth it, isn't it? And uh, let's see, so uh, cancers in your work, you can expect a new start to happen for you. Some of you could be um, getting a new sort of uh, new opportunities, new, uh, you know, bosses, new colleagues. Maybe you're being moving to shifting or relocating to a new job, new university colleges, something new is starting for you and it will excite you. Also, this will be something which is very close to your heart. So your career is very important to you, Cancers. You will be putting in a lot of love, effort and, you know, uh, whatever you will be doing in your uh, career, it will be from your heart. You will be giving it all. And I think for some of you, if you are single, you may actually avoid love and, uh, you know, you will make your business, your career, your education, your like the love of your life. I don't know why, but it feels like you are in love with whatever you are working with in the month, in the coming month. Also, um, I see you getting some recognition and rewards and awards for your hard work. Your hard work will pay off cancer. So congratulations. Hope, yes, keep your hopes high because your hopes will be fulfilled. I also feel um, cancers, you know, number 17 is going to be lucky for you. I also feel that, you know, whatever you're wishing for, it's going to happen for you and it will quite surprise you. Like, you know, I never expected I would clear the exam, I would get through, but you will be happily surprised. So certain new things are happening which you have not planned and they will actually be very good for you. So yeah, get ready. Any advice? 
<coughs> Ooh, harmony and resolution. So end of conflict is coming for you. Uh, love and harmony is coming for you. Take charge in action. Yeah, I do feel some of you are going to decide what you really want in your future. And you're going to take the next action steps. And you're going to feel very happy about it. I just saw 1515 on the, you know, camera. Opportunities. An important offer will be made. Be prepared and dress to impress. So yeah, important uh, opportunities are coming. Ooh, jealousy. Watch who you trust with your personal secrets and plans. Spend time outdoors with nature to reconnect and replenish. Yeah, I do feel like in love there could be a lot of jealousy. There could be a lot of third party situations affecting you even at work. Uh, there could be people who are jealous. So just be careful. Your love life. Ooh, cancer. Affairs of the heart could, cross, could cause future problems. But take heart as difficult situations will be resolved by a good decision this week. So something is going to be resolved very quickly into your in your love life. So stay positive, cancers. And subscribe, Magic Wednesday. Like, share, join us on Insta. And this is Mystic C. Singh. Bye-bye.